Hi everyone, I'm Rebecca and and I'm Cheryl and welcome, welcome back, back to Little, Little Wonder. I wonder who our next Little Wonder will be. Hmm. Yeah. Well, we were just talking about how smart he was, right? Oh, yes. I just remembered again. I'm remembering a lot today that <laughs> her next person is Ditya, and she's also very smart because she's a master chess player. A chess player? Wow. Mm -hmm. And she's very, very good. I'm not just saying like she plays once a day. She's like went to tournaments and like won, won them and everything. Yeah. So now introducing Ditya. I am 9 years old. I live in Melbourne, Australia. I am the elder child of my parents. I have a 5 year old younger sister. I started chess at the age of 7. In a short time, I started liking it. Eventually, it became my passion. In my typical day, I solve many chess puzzles and I play few games online. I play with my sister, do karate at times and do abacus mathematics. I won over 50 trophies and medals so far in chess and karate. I won few state level and national level chess tournaments. My aim is to become Australian Junior National Chess Champion and World Youth Rapid Chess Champion. Next month, I am representing Australia in World Youth Rapid Chess Championship. One day, I want to become a Grandmaster in Chess and also become a doctor and save many lives. My coaches are Mr. Amitpal, Mr. Miguel and my uncle Chanakya. Never give up. Losses in our games are stepping stones for future success. I learn Indian classical music, I play guitar and I am learning piano. Hi, Hi Ditya. Ditya! Welcome to Little, Little Wonder. Wonder. So we'll be asking you a few questions. You ready? Okay. Yes. Yes. So my first question is, who was your toughest opponent? I think my toughest opponent was my coach. So you go to tournaments, right? Probably a club. How um, do you prepare yourself before each game? I prepare myself by logging onto my computer and finding my opponent's book and checking what they play and prepare against the people. That's good. Uh, can you please share some of your strategies or like tips and tricks for us for some beginners? Practice chess every day, play more games, and do lots of puzzles. And also, do you normally like playing chess on like a kind of device or do you normally do face to face? Which one do you find better? Online uh, or face to face? I think I would find better online. If you were to vest me, how many moves do you think you could win? Maybe 30. Fair enough. Who's, the fa who's your favorite ca well, character? But your who do you use the most? The horse, the queen, the king? You can't really move the king as much, but. I think the knight. The knight, that's your favorite one. Uh, so why do you like the knight? I like the knight because it can jump over pieces. That's a good choice. Do you like to start off or second? Uh, I like playing white. White first, yes. Um, well, if there wasn't a horse, um, the, the knight, sorry. If there wasn't a knight, then what other one is your second favorite? The queen. In your eye, which character is the most powerful for you you to use? I think the queen because I can move it diagonally and it's um, Have you ever taught anyone how to play chess? Yes, I have. Who? Uh, my sister and friends. Your sister and your friends? Uh, do your relatives, like your mom and dad and your sister, play with you to like help you or to learn them and learn the game itself? They know how to play chess. I do help them. Oh, you taught them. What inspired you to start playing chess? 
my uncle inspired me to start playing chess. In a short time, I started liking it and developing it. How long or like how much do you practice? Every day I practice about one and a half hour. One and a half hour. How do you try to like improve? Like would you um, try to see in a game, play a game and find your weaknesses? Or would you just think of them and try to get everything greater or better? I would do puzzles to get better. On computer? Yes, on the computer. Yes. So I heard you went on a tournament last week. Yes. How did that go? It was a good experience with lots of strong players. I stood in 25th position. 25th? Yes. Um, when I... you get older, would you like to be a professional chess player and like teach others and be like your coach? Yes, I would. Oh, I heard in the Melbourne city, there's a huge chess play. There's like huge um, pawns and everything like that. Have you ever tried um, playing with them? Have you been there? Yes, I have. Wow, I hope to go there one day. Have you like been anybody way older than you? Yes. Do you have any hilarious memories of you playing chess? In the tournament where I got to play four moves, I didn't like the tracks I was going to <laughs> Okay, so now we're going to ask you a riddle, and if you get it correct, you're going to get a big prize, okay? Okay. You ready? Yes. Uh, so now make sure you have your listening ears on, because I'm about to say the question, okay? Okay. So Mrs. Brown has five daughters, and each daughter has one brother. How many children does she have all together? Make sure you think this very thoroughly. It's supposed to trick your mind. Mary has five daughters and all those daughters have one brother. How many kids does Mary have? Each of those daughters has one brother. There are five girls. It's a trick question. Ten. Ten? Is think that your final very answer? Very thoroughly. I think very thoroughly. There are five girls and each of them has one brother. Say you have a sister and um, has a brother, and you have a brother, let's say. So your sister also has a brother, so do you. So how many brothers are there and girls and together? How many kids in I total? Think the riddle is because one brother is same like my sisters. Yes. And so how many kids does Mary have all together? Six. Congratulations, you just won an a, a voucher from aladdincart.com.au. And very good job on sol solving the riddle. First you were a bit confused, but now you got the correct answer. Great job. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for joining yes. us. And answering a few questions that we would also getting to know you. And we hope you have a great new year. Bye. Bye.